on a beautiful sunny day. Number one and all his friends. Hi, From everyone. number two all the way up to number ten. Decided to meet up at the park for a fun day of play. They were excited to laugh, explore, and enjoy the sunshine together. But as they lined up to start a game, something a little funny happened. All right, everyone, let's line up and make sure all of us are here. I'll count to check that no one's missing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and another eight and a eleven. Something is not right. Wait a minute, we have two eights and then eleven showed up too. But where are nine and ten? Great question number one. Sometimes when we're missing a few numbers, we can use a handy little trick called subtraction. Subtraction helps us figure out how many we need by taking some away. Let's see if we can work together to find out how to get just the numbers from 1 to 10. Since we have two 8s, let's try having one of the 8s step out of the line to see if that helps. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, but still no 9 or 10. Good try. That's what subtraction is all about. Taking one number away to see what's left. Let's try another way. Let's subtract one from number 11, which is already here, and see if that helps. That's a great idea. If we subtract one from 11, we get 10. Let's do it. Wait, what does it mean to subtract one from me? How does that work? It's simple. Subtraction is just taking away. If we imagine that you, number 11, are holding 11 apples and you give one apple away, you'll have 10 apples left. That's how subtraction works. Oh, I get it now. So, if I subtract one, I become 10. Let me try. Wow, that really worked. Now I am number 10. Yay, now we have a number 10. But wait a second. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight, and ten. Oh no, we're still missing number nine. That's right. We shouldn't forget about number nine. But don't worry, there's a way we can solve this. Remember when we learned about addition? And now we have an extra number one from subtracting it from number 11. We can use that extra number one and add it to number eight to make number nine. When we add one to eight, we count up. Eight plus one equals nine. So now number eight transforms into number nine. Hooray! Now we have all the numbers from one to 10. Our group is complete. Great job, everyone. Today, we used subtraction to take one away from number 11, and then addition to add that extra one to number 8, creating number 9. What a fantastic team effort! Subtraction and addition are such powerful tools for solving problems with numbers. You've all done an amazing job today, and we can't wait to see you next time for more number adventures. Stay curious, keep exploring, and never stop learning, little adventurers.